Yeah, the first time I went to uh, French club, it was, uh, geez, I was about 10, 10 years old, like, uh, so I was one of the younger lads in the group, but uh, yeah, just, especially when you go at that kind of age, just you get used to playing against the older lads, playing at that different level, I guess. Yeah. Such a good crack, and the coach was so good that I had to come back another two or three times. Um, coaching, like, coaching kind of different school, because school would be, like, uh, just kind of team-based, just, like, moves and stuff, where this more skills working on your passing your handling your footwork different stuff like that so uh yeah it's more one-on-one -on -one base working your condition stuff the way it's just before you come back to school in that kind of august period you're fit you're ready to go almost a step ahead of the rest of the players um uh, but like the crack is unreal like you meet the lads you may never have met before and they just true play rugby um it's just savage like some lads you meet uh Different, different parts of the world, like some lads I knew from Barbados and stuff like that. Great lads and uh, yeah, great rugby. Um, different activities you do and like uh, go sailing beside a beautiful lake there beside the beside the tents. Go sailing, go swimming. Uh, beach close to Northern, I think it brought me on my my career savagely. So uh, I definitely look back and uh, that is fond memories and I think that would be uh, something that I'd, I'd recommend to anyone because. Uh, some of the stuff you get out there is culture wise, fun wise, meet new lads, it's a uh, it's top quality and you're not gonna find a better one you can't put nothing anywhere else.